So the next step would be here, anyone can step on it. Thank you. So here the iron took shape from 2001 till 2006. They started from the big water to protect the iron from the waves and natural elements. Next step. In this step now we are building the base. In the base they use 120 million cubic meters of sea sand from the bottom of the sea. While in the breakwater they use 7 million tons of rocks. In this step we are now completing the 17 fronts with 1,500 private villas. In each front we have approximately 100 villas. With two channels on the both sides to circulate the water inside and outside the island. And the last step. So here as you see the island is completed and the trunk with 2,500 apartments. Our location here in the middle at Nakhil Mall. And for this small island, it's a private island, belongs to His Highness a Sheikh Hamad bin Rashid Al Makhi, the ruler of all behind the construction. In only a few seconds, I will enter inside. Do you have any questions? Great job. Don't worry. The people who are living on the shore of the sea, with their friends, were living in a house and living on the shore of the sea. And I was trying to live in the sea of the sea. وكان الحكيم والآن كثيرا ما أصبحكم إلى مشروع النقراض المبالغ التي في البحث دعونا نتحاور ونفكر في المستقبل ليكون لدينا جميعا رؤية واضحة فدعونا نفوض معا معركة التنمية وليكن من وحيانا الفقر والجهد والتقنية in 1997, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE and ruler of Dubai, embarked on a project that would transform Dubai's coastline and give the world one of its most recognizable man-made wonders, a technological marvel. Palm Jumeirah has become a symbol of not only Dubai's rich heritage and deep connection to the sea, but a shining beacon of ambition and innovation that can be found in the Arab world. This is the incredible story of how the island that captured the world's imagination rose from the sea. Welcome to the view at the pub. From warm, shallow waters lapping at the coastline of the Gulf to a dazzling symbol of imagination and architectural ingenuity, this is the Palm Jumeirah. The iconic island was born from a vision to create an unforgettable masterpiece that would showcase the spirit of human possibility and transform the Emirate into a buzzing metropolis and a global tourist destination. His Excellency Sultan Ahmed bin Stegna was mandated by His Highness to bring this great idea to life where the island's original design was shaped like a sun. It will mean how many kilometers? Okay, it will be this island. It will be seven kilometers. We all turn wine at 70. It will be the whole beach of Dubai. It will be 60, 65 kilometers. But you get 70. He said, why do we build it around? Why do we put it in the sides that create more beaches? The redesign included a 1.4 kilometer bridge connecting the Dubai mainland to the island. The shape then began to resemble a palm tree, a true Dubai icon. Nearly 100 million cubic meters of sand from the bottom of the sea and 7 million tons of rock from nearby mountains in the northern Emirates were carefully positioned using GPS technology and satellite images from space to create one of the most recognizable icons of Dubai. Constructed in less than six years, from 2001 to 2006, the first of its kind man-made island is a monumental feat of engineering and modern technology. It is one of the few islands in the world that can be viewed from space with the naked eye. 
Today, we welcome you to experience a pioneering summer of device transformation into one of the world's most exciting cities. Designed to inspire wonder, this unforgettable, iconic, and awe-inspiring journey brings the story of Pangea to life for the first time. Controlling the speed. I'm just kidding. What floor we are? Certificate.
not permitted on the flight. Flash photography is not permitted at any time. You will be passing through a secure...